Last day in the United States, tomorrow we leave for England. So I'm gonna do things that I'm not gonna be able to do for the next two weeks. Like, like eating at Chick-fil-A. There's no grilled chicken Chick-fil-A nuggets in England. There is no grilled chicken sandwich with bacon in England. So I'm getting that in right now. Sitting here eating this Chick-fil-A, thinking about all the things that I'm gonna not have in England is making me think that maybe today I should just do a bunch of stuff besides eat Chick-fil-A that I won't be able to do in England. Besides this, there's also this, what? Yeah, this is a Diet Dr. Pepper mm. with sugar-free van vanilla, no, sugar-free coconut. Yeah, you can't get this in the UK. When you guys start bringing Diet Dr. Pepper with sugar-free coconut to the UK, I'll start considering moving there full time. Uh, don't quote me on that, I just bought a house. What are some other things we could do? Hmm. Oh, we can also work out. Last workout here at Fitness Culture. thing and the most important thing that I'm gonna do before I leave because I can't do it in England is play with this little one hi there oh my baby oh dad's gonna miss you dad's gonna miss you yes you will oh yes you will look how sweet she is I've never really been the one who's worried always been the one who's keeping it cool the kind of guy you chill while others hurry. Time is up here in St. George. Gotta fly. We're gonna take off to England. Gonna be up there in the sky. Let's go. Whoa, how about that transition? We are in London. We just got to London Heathrow here. We're gonna go meet up with some friends, kind of check into our hotel. It's about 80 degrees here in London. This never happens. We're gonna enjoy it. I see a problem here. Really? They don't have a place for Courtney to sleep. You're funny. Ha -ha. This bed is so tiny. Look how like English our room is. Like I think that's tea on the wall. <laughs> our room is so English and dark. But at least it's sunny up. Can you imagine if it was cloudy out how dark this room would be? That would be horrible. I would just want to sit inside and read all day. Um, no wonder people in England sound like they read a lot and they have good vocabulary. Good job, people. So Look at this, though. This bed. Ugh. Ugh. Where are you going to sleep, babe? You know what, babe? You know what? I think you're a good thing you're small. I think the closet is just big enough. First, you tell me I'm going to taxi drive you around. And then you kick me out of did the say bed. That. I'm being so mean. It's my British sense of humor coming out. Um, speaking of British, we're gonna go meet up with my favorite Brit, Brit, Brit in the world. One of, one of. I don't want him to get a big head. Mr. Sean Stafford. We're gonna go have dinner tonight. Um, it's gonna be epic because the chef is the man. And you guys have the hookups. And he friends. made us food last year, so we're gonna go see. It's a new place this year, so we're gonna go eat there. So last year when we were in London, we went out to eat with Sean Stafford, Courtney, like we made a YouTube video out of it. You guys can check it out tonight. But the same, the same chef that created that masterpiece has created a masterpiece for us here tonight. And this is the first, the pork croquette and then the special donut. And there we go. Beautiful background. I talked to his sister about this, and he's like very... How is it? Because I really like... How's your donut? Blue cheese donut? She's more... This one messes with my mind. You don't like it? No, because I feel like it's like a donut. But then it's not sweet. I don't know. I like the pork one, though. Michaela doesn't... Yeah, yeah. Courtney's just queen picker. 
This is our third or course. Or if she hasn't, she didn't have any of these, and she is picky but but no. you're getting in on that salad. I am. Uh, it's tuna tartare, mango, and we don't know what these green things are. What could like this be? I think it's cucumber. Mm. They're very green. Like, we have like two mutual friends. Cucumber. Here, but one of them I wish to learn. <laughs> <about. laughs> And this dude over here, it's really like, freaking me so out. Our mutual friends are like his friends. His car is set up for an American, like, it's it nice driving, it's he's driving on the left side. It's a nice car. Who he left for me? It's sketchy. Though. Oh, he finally got something she could so eat, a salad. I have been eating. You're going to get this calamari? I like calamari. This is 10,000 calorie challenge, <laughs> England fancy food. That's good. That's really good. And then the salad. It's also pretty. I have to shoot in the morning, so this is just grand. The world's biggest burger. Oh my gosh. So, Courtney has some stomach issues, and also she just doesn't like eating as bad as I do. So we're getting all this naughty stuff. Like we just got this croquet sandwich thing. What did he? I don't know. It's like, it was like ham, ham, cheese. And I say, Courtney, like I'm getting stressed. I feel like I'm the only person eating here. So what does she say? Hold on. All you have to do is just break things up slightly like this. Just pull it apart. You know, you got into it. You went in. Oh, thank you. Oh, you went in. It was a nice yeah, I had something untoward. Perfect. Nothing untoward. So much food. What do we got here? This is the last round. Chicken. A chicken dish, truffle fries, mac and cheese, Caesar salad. Oh, so that epic meal, these two's fault right here. We got Isaac and Aaron here. You guys, you guys killed it again. Cheers, man. I'm gonna add a clip to this video of last year's meal. This is everything I've dreamt of. Almost as good as, no, I would say it's better with the sauce. I probably eaten legit about 8,000 calories today. All I know is a damn good day though. This tops it off though. The Sunday yeah, roast. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I feel like we, a lot was sent back last year. I tried not yeah, to send a lot of food both times. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so, I feel like I need to go, I just got off a plane. I feel like I need to go walk around London. Go do some cardio? <laughs> yes, because that's amazing. So these guys, you guys can find them here at the Claret. Is that how you say it? Claret, yeah. Claret. Yeah. That's Got that yeah, I got to work <laughs> on my English accent there. The claret, so come check it out. Look how, look how like just proper English it looks. So like, it looks perfect. So and then tell these two I sent you guys. So say hey, I need, I want to speak to the chef, and people are gonna think you're really pissed off. And then it's just gonna be all be good things. So. Come here, we'll look after you. Awesome. That is a day one here in London. I gotta get a battery for this camera tomorrow. Thanks guys for giving us that amazing dinner tonight. Those two are the lads. Um, tomorrow I gotta shoot the gym shark. <sighs> this room is super duper messy though, so we're gonna do that right now, aren't we? We are. Hi. Hi. What are you doing over there? I'm making this tea. Tea. Uh -huh. What time is it right now? It's 10 o'clock here in the UK, and I'm just now starting to upload footage. So. Hopefully this gets to you guys by tomorrow. I'm uploading the footage back to Jason who's in the States. We're gonna try this out. Hopefully the videos don't suffer. Let's make a thumbs up on this because I'm having to do all this work.